hi guys welcome back to my channel for those of you that don't know me my name is katie and i love to make home decor and lifestyle videos here on youtube so today's video it's a day in a life type of vlog so i hope you guys enjoy so guys welcome to a sunday in our life the first thing that i do as soon as i wake up on the weekend or any day for that matters is unload the dishwasher that's like the first thing that i do put everything back on its place before i even start making breakfast so here i am just putting dishes away and finally i don't know if you remember my black friday haul from jc penny i'm going to be using this griddle here for breakfast and i am excited to try it for the first time And of course, my little helper is here helping me. He's making the pancake mix. You guys, Jaden is growing so fast, my little boy. Um, and I'm just gonna go ahead and connect, um, plug in the griddle. And here he is mashing his Oreos. He loves pancakes with Oreos. They're so delicious, by the way. I added some bacon in there and we're gonna get to breakfast. By the way, you guys, if you don't have one of these griddle things, you need one in your life. Making breakfast on this was so simple and delicious, by the way. We're here just eating and enjoying our breakfast, and then I realized I had syrup all over my hair, so you already know. That's what I was doing there. As soon as we were done with our breakfast, Jaden is usually the last person because he keeps watching videos while he eats. So then I just start washing everything that we use for breakfast. So that means clean up the kitchen again. I know. Once I'm done with the kitchen, I go into the family room just to tidy up this area because we stayed up on Saturday late watching movies and I didn't do any tidy up. Then the hobby is going to go ahead today and put on this new camera system because our old ones were giving us problems and we found this one on Amazon, very affordable. The baby finished with the cameras. Mama. Hi baby. And we're headed to Ikea you guys. I am looking for some storage solutions for my bathroom because you guys, you guys already know I lack storage and I want to start doing like a bathroom refresh now for spring and get organized. So we're going to go ahead and head to Ikea. We're almost there. Um, it is so nice out. The weather, it's nice and cool here in South Florida. Jaden, I thought you fell asleep. <laughs> There is only one of you, only one of me There's a million of those who won't let us be But they're not gonna, not gonna see me bleed Cause baby, I got you, 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 you I've been beaten to the ground, dragged across the dirt I've been scared to live cause some people never learn Kia, I did find some storage solutions for the bathrooms. Um, I didn't purchase any of them yet. I just want to look at them and go back into my house, into my bathroom and kind of measure and make sure um, what I saw at the store would work in my space. But I like this one right here, but of course in white, I don't want to do that gray color. I also thought this little bench here was great for my mud room that I'm working on. And then the hobby thought this bookshelf would also work for the bathroom, for the storage that I want. I also saw this one with the glass panels and that might also work. So I don't know, we'll stay tuned though. But here I wanted to show you the lacquers that I use for the shelves in the kitchen. So those are the ones a lot of people ask me all the time and they were only $24.99 from here from Ikea. So this storage combination here, I loved it. I thought it was the perfect size for my, you know, toilet room. So I'm thinking of getting this one definitely. And then we got to my mom's house, Jaden and daddy started fishing. We ate there and then we headed back home. And on our way, we stopped at Walmart because we needed some stuff. 
for spring and summer for the backyard so we got the spotlights i always buy this solar lights they're like amazing the price went up this year so they're like 12 something last year they were like eight bucks but you know everything is going up guys always check the planter section at ikea because you could be using these beautiful planters as bases for your florals so i got this one these are new this year i also found some storage solution for my new pantry that we're gonna be sharing that makeover soon so that's what i'm doing here just looking for that kind of stuff i want to get organized this year so it's gonna be a lot of storage and you know stuff like that how cute is this So Walmart has other Valentine's Day goodies out already so if you do little baskets for your teachers or for the kids you know little Valentine's Day baskets this is your time to go there now and start buying those stuff they also have decor and stuff like that and lots and lots of candy and chocolate oh my goodness so many cute stuff we got home i thought we were gonna put this more like in march but the hobby got desperate and started putting all his little new lights in the backyard to light up the fence so i'll be watching his greca he's worried about his cafecito para la mañanita and then we're gonna go ahead and probably watch a movie to finish setting up the solar little lights in the backyard you can see them glowing back there and then i'm just gonna chill watch a movie order a pizza maybe it's super early it's only 7 30 and I am up on Monday. So we don't have to do much cleaning today, but like what I do at night after we're done watching movies, I go ahead and put everything on, you know, on its place and vacuum because I like to wake up to like a very nice and clean space. So yeah, that was pretty much for my Sunday, you guys. <laughs> So we couldn't really find a good movie, so I decided to finish my show. I was watching Jenny and Georgia. I don't know if any of you watch it. If you do, let me know down in the comments how you like it. I watched the whole entire new season. And finally, the piece that got here, and I'm so angry because it ended up being the Ron toppings. Like, who the hell? Whose pizza they sent me? Those were not my toppings. But anyways, we ate it. So this vlog was supposed to end on Sunday, but because it was all over the place <laughs> and there was not much um, that I was doing, I decided to share some of my half a day of what I did on Monday on my day off. And the first thing that I did as soon as I wake up was head downstairs and vacuum the entire house. I always want to make sure that I tidy up anytime um, before I leave my home. I like to always, you know, have a clean house. And when I come home, I want everything to be you know organized and stuff like that so that's just me and i'm always cleaning that's just my life i just got ready for the day today it's monday it's a holiday i am off work so jay doesn't have school either we had breakfast finished you know doing a little tidy up before we head out and we go shopping oh see what that stores i'm excited for spring and summer so i am like looking for a lot of outdoor stuff this year i really want to make the outdoors a place we don't want to leave so that's the goal the door are you ready to go shopping but look whatever i need to buy for me oh really is yeah. that like a challenge we're doing we're doing a challenge no we're not yes we are when you need to buy it. Ah. Go. Get in the car. Stop. Me, TJ Max. What if I touch? No. Yes, yes. No, 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 no. Yes, we, are. we don't have a deal. Stop. So I have some stuff to return here at TJ's. So at TJ Maxx, they of course have all of the Valentine's decor out already, but they have some really cute pads and pants and plates and cups and mugs. Oh my God, you name it. 
but they also started to bring out sprints so I saw a lot of florals at TJ Maxx as well. Then you guys, I stopped by Ross and I picked up this cute little plate set. It's like to do like a Mexican party because I don't know, it's just giving me Mexican vibes over here. Has a tortilla plate, the avocado, the taco um, dish holder thing. It was super cute. And then I headed to Home Goods and honestly, I've been so disappointed at Home Goods lately. My local Home Goods, they just don't bring anything that says Katie, take me home. So that was pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this day in my life. See you all on the next one. God bless.